All right, everybody. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. The Adventure of Criminal the Fallen Angel. And apparently we are on our way to trying to redeem us ourselves. Now, last time we did stop into the stronghold of the goblins. The goblins. And we got Mintara right here. Now, I do want to actually talk to her. I do want to talk to her. So let's see what she got to say. Your scouting party has not returned, and half of the intruders escaped your guards. Sorry, mistress. We mucked up. Until their sanctuary is found, I will take something precious from you every hour that passes. A trinket, a tongue, a limb. I ain't no use without my limbs. The lads will make the prisoner squeal soon enough. I swear. Silence now, creature. Or I will silence you forever. Okay. As she turns to you, her thoughts mingle with yours. A cold hand caressing your brain. The chamber melts away to reveal a dark, endless nowhere. In it, you see a vision. The drow listens as a pale-eyed young woman whispers in her ear. Pale-eyed young the voice woman. Spoke of, one of the chosen. Huh. The vision fades away. A true soul? Praise be. Are you here to join my hunt? Ooh, I have business at the moonrise. Can you provide safe passage? I'm here to kill you. Five, five, five. Hmm. While I would like to enter Carlac's good graces. <laughs> um, yeah, let's, let's not kill her. She is giving me some options here. And uh, I am pretty sure... Okay, I'm like a 50-50 sure that you could maybe possibly make her join your party. Just because, well, she's not a goblin. She's very obviously out of place here in, the, in this stronghold of them gobbles. Very obviously out of place. And she is very obviously giving us some, some choices. Now, the question is, what do I go for? Provide safe passage to Moonrise. We are true soul. But she be level higher than us. She could probably, if not modded, solo wipe our entire party right now. Just because she's level 6. I'm saying probably. If this was unmodded with 4 party members, I would probably get shit on. Especially since there's another goblin in there. And the... the fucking eye which if i recall uh screeches and just makes people come there <laughs> yeah also the this, these eyes are just pretty much known to screech and such uh, i recall the eye being something similar to lord of the rings yes the, the kind of like sauron's eye Good old Sauron, yes. A hunt, who's the target? I have my own business to take care of. Hmm, let's go with option number two, even though it's pretty obvious that it is the grove. I could ask for safe passage, but we do have a tadpole in our heads and we are a true soul and she may take offense to that <laughs> who the target worshippers of a false god their existence is an insult to the absolute's claim on this region. who the flip is this absolute bro the absolute seeks i'm sure those wretches have it hidden away there we will find it amongst the dead and the ashes her excitement is palpable 
She lingers on thoughts of victory, of unbelievers' blood spilled, and of the weapon. She will seize it in the absolute's name. Ah, the night song. Shadow Heart's anxiety. The weapon the absolute seeks. It's the ultimate she carries. The same one that protected you as you entered the goblin camp. Her mind focuses. The cultists cannot discover that the weapon they seek is within their grasp. The thief, whimpering in our dungeon, tried to flee to their sanctuary. Oh, he gone. We will continue to remove parts of him until he tells us exactly where it is. He's been resilient, but he'll talk. Nah, he gone. She's I saved his ass. Visited. Sorry. <laughs> around yours hmm warn the tieflings lead her to the tieflings might doom her but it would earn you her trust perhaps you can misdirect her or kill her earn her trust by killing the grove now that I know I can now, which would mean she'd probably join our, join our party instantly. Uh, she's a level 6, which would probably level my entire party up to hers. I'm just assuming here, I don't, I don't know. Misdirect her. If I misdirect her. I could try something, so I misdirect her to kill her. I hit her with something that is called Shadow Heart's thing, which makes her undead. I kill her off, so then she revives at 1 HP. And uh, hopefully combat ends? Question mark? Before she revives? Is that... Does that work? And then maybe I talk to her again? Question mark? I am a little bit confused on what, I, on what I'm trying to plan here. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I could just kill the tieflings though. I am an Oathbreaker. I don't personally care for the Grove all that much. But at the same time... I do have Tifling Ancestry, because uh, that's what I chose when I created the character with the updated mod list. So I am basically half Tifling, half half Angel. Hmm. Let's just misdirect. Speak, true soul. The hunt must begin soon. Are, are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god, even the, the Oathbreaker Paladin in me wants to kill her. Oi, oi, oi. Alright, fuck it. Um, I, I did just save the prisoner. Gale and Karlak doesn't like this. Apparently Shadowheart does, but we did just save him, if I recall. So we should have talked to Minthara first? Hmm. We do have the Oathbreaker one, though. So this is quite literally probably gonna send us to... Path to Redemption, if we, could, if we keep using the Oathbreaker things. Maybe. I'm just assuming here, but... Kinda looks to me like not something an Oathbreaker would say. Not one that maybe, you know, doesn't want to repent. Anyway, I do need to respec. Or do I? Do I need to respec? Technically, yes, but... Practically, right now, not really. Hmm. <clears throat> I don't, if, I, if I choose this, I don't know how it's gonna affect the story. 
But if I choose this, I'm definitely killing off Mintora. But let's go with option one. Be sure not to kill him before he talks. Alright. Starion is at zero. Is he? I, I may need to start pleasing a Starion a little. He's at ten. Okay. Like your words is meaningless wealth. End the matter. Alright, where where the guy at? Where the guy at? Let's see, where are you telling me to go? Defeat Goblin Leaders, find Goblin Priestess, defeat Goblin Leaders, reach Githyanki Crash, okay, return to Zevlor. I am confused a little bit. Interrogate prisoner. Where? Hold up. Where are you at? I need to attempt to find that out. So I kind of just need to go all the way back. In before you're telling me good old prisoner is right back at the grove. If you're wondering why my voice sounds like this, I don't know, bro. I. Literally just woke up, had a rough night, so yeah, couldn't sleep, maybe that's why. <clears throat> my throat's a little bit, yeah. Also, I haven't had my coffee yet, so that may affect. Better not be cursed. Okay, let's go enter passageway. We are on a mission from Minthara. Not sure how this is gonna work, but where are you at? Inside Emerald Grove. Not sure I like it. Save the refugees, return to Zevlor. Okay, since we are going into the grove, might as well talk to Zevlor. See what he gotta say. I'm still not sure if I wanna save the grove, but we'll see. We'll see. Alright, we got Zevlor over here. I heard what happened. Thank you for protecting the child. If the druids are this far gone, then it's not just goblins we have to fear. So we can risk violence here, or face it for certain on the road. Quite the choice, isn't it? I'm not here to advise you, I'm here to make sure you leave. Broke oath. Ah. Hmm. We got another broken oath thing. Ah, yeah, yeah. Well, at the same time... The druids very much obviously don't want the tieflings here, but at the same time, Halston, if and when he comes back, he might have something to say about it. But at the same time, I also got the broke oath thing again. You know, I'm probably gonna have to fight Zevlor if I choose this. Sure. Korgas twisted your mind. No, I'm just a messenger, bro. Don't hate. Just listen. Sending us out there is a death sentence. But there is another way. If you want to turn your blade on anyone, turn it on the goblins. You won't be able to okay. put them all down. There's a horde of good them out shit, there. Good shit, good shit. But they're ill-disciplined. It's unusual for them to organize so cleverly. Somebody must be leading them. Bringing discipline to their ranks. Hey, that's probably Minthora. 
and they'll scatter. The Blade of Frontiers has done what he can to help us prepare for the journey, and we are grateful. But it'll be a short journey if the goblins still own the roads. By the Triad, there is only one correct answer. Refuse him, and we sentence these people to die. Ah. Uh, bro, Asterion does not like any of the fucking choices we got, ever. <laughs> Except the one where it said to hand him over the book, which I did not do, by the way. <laughs> uh, sure, I'll, I'll see what I can do. Everyone in this camp depends on it. <clears throat> I need to start pleasing Asterion somehow. <laughs> as soon as you give word. Ah, fuck, I just burned my throat with hot coffee. Oh god, bro. Oh, that was so bad. Alright. That was so bad. <clears throat> I don't know, I just didn't feel the coffee being all that hot when it entered my mouth, but when it went down the throat... Sheesh! Is he up here? Oh, no he not. Where is Guy? Raid the Emerald Grove? Raid? Wait. What? Also, he's supposed to be here? Oh. <laughs> I didn't see the guy sleeping here. Alright. Let's talk, dude. Okay, but should we talk? What if... Well, he technically got nothing. Let's try to talk again? The adventurer sleeps soundly. I'm sorry, His what? Steady. His wounds expertly bandaged. How am I supposed to... How am I supposed to interrogate? Confusion? I also just realized I got two rituals for the uh, speak with dead. For some reason. Not exactly sure why. Do I have something that's giving me another one? That's kind of weird, actually. Mm, do I have anything? Because if, if I want to do the, the thing that I want to do and try to get me in Tora, here's what I want to do. I'm not sure if it's going to work, though, because I don't actually have that spell that I would like to have. So, there is a spell in the game, from what I've seen, that says that uh, you can uh, subjugate the undead. So, if I make me in Thora... An undead with the Valkyrana's import on that from Shadowheart, and then I use that spell. Or I could just animate her while after she's dead. If, if I use the other spell, after she revives as an undead, I could technically subjugate me in Thora and make her join me. But I do not have that one. Why do I not have that one? What is the level requirement for that? Or do I need a certain class? Hmm. I am the cleric. And you would assume the cleric would have access to that. But maybe I literally need the necromancy class from, uh, I believe it's wizard? I think Gale is the only one that actually has access to that one. I might have to switch or to multi-class into wizard for that one. 
I might. I'm not completely sure though. God, I wish I could respec without having to break my oath. I mean, without having to repent and... Re hey, soldier. What? I do not recall clicking Karlak? Weird. Anyway, how do I make this guy uh, squeal, bro? How do you make him talk? We are supposed to interrogate, dude. But dude's sleeping. What if I help? He can't be helped. He's gone. He's too far gone. Alright, Shadow Heart. Let's get on with it. Cure wounds? Will this really work? Because technically he got no issue. I'm just saying. Maybe in the head from too much. I this may fail, but man, all right, let's let's try, let's see what this does. All right, will you wake up after this healing? Adventurous sleep. No. Soundly, his breath steady, his wounds expertly bandaged. Bro, my guy Liam, wake up! I almost want to hit him. I almost want to hit him, I'm not gonna lie. Thing is, I don't know if hitting him will help. Well, maybe. What if I push? And these things have stayed interesting. Get up, dude! How am I supposed to interrogate, dude? I'm sorry, but... He literally won't wake up even after I push him. <laughs> what is this? Direct me. Do I have a certain type of spell? That would allow me to wake him up. I have a bunch of speak with dead. Hmm. There is nothing. Keep a blade close. What am I Quite literally nothing that would allow me to wake him up right now. Maybe if I throw water at him. I'll try. Do I have water? How about some grease? Hey, what what the water be doing? Where is my bottle? My bottle. My bottle of water. Do I even have any? I'm sorry, I know my my British accent is not the best. Do I literally have no water? Hello? What the water be doing? Okay, Starion, wake him up. Why? What do you mean, why? I'm trying to wake you up. Oh my god, he's talking in his sleep? He just said, why did you do that? Bro, guy pissing me off. Alright. Never mind. Never freaking mind. We got Saza over here, apparently. Which I recall talking to her, and she didn't say much. But wait, wait, what? I just teleported outside the grove game. Why am I not allowed to? Is this teleporter inside the grove and I don't know it? Because I'm pretty sure that was right outside the grove. All right, I'm, I'll choose this one. See if it works. For some reason, that one is teleporting us right inside the grove. Oh. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna wait, I'm sorry. <laughs> On that note... Oh. Uh, okay. Good show. Come on, Gale. Alright. Saza is literally still here, bro. What the flip? Gonna go tell the commander about you. you didn't move. Okay. I am confusion. Well, this is no good. This is no good. Back to Gobbo Camp. Alright, so what am I doing? I don't technically gotta kill the goblins. Well, I, I kinda do, but at the same time, not really. I just need to remove their leadership, if you know what I mean. After I deal with me and Thora, I might just, uh... Do I want to touch? Do I want to touch Truth Old Gut real quick? It, it may start a fight. I'm not gonna do that. Oh, I feel like I'm about to sneeze. Ah, shit. That that, that feels so bad in my nose, bro. All right, give me a sec. Ah. Yeah, I had to mute on that one. I may have to mute another time. <sighs> Alright, let me try to talk to me Thor again. Report and make it quick. Organizing these creatures tests my patience. Alright, um The prisoner did escape. Uh, you know what? We are the Oathbreaker. Might as well choose the path of the Oathbreaker at this point. Let me see your map. Their fate is sealed, and you will be instrumental in the slaughter. Go to their refuge and make your way inside. As a friend. Been there, done that. What else? We got an Aussie more specific. Huh. I don't have the most trustworthy face. They're half devil refugees. Nobody wants them. A drowning creature. Why do you want them though? If nothing else is offered. Be that blade. I will gather a raiding party and move into position. You will open mm. the gates from the inside when the time is right to strike. We will cleanse the place of infidels. All right. And Burn it to the ground in the absolute's name. So here's the thing. We'll be the first among I'm gonna roleplay a little. Uh we are faithless. We are an oathbreaker. And if I add my own as in my, my real life beliefs and such to the mix. We don't technically have the moral high ground to judge whether or not killing off the grove is good or bad. Or whether or not, well actually technically if I look at it, in any way shape or form it may be bad. But, we are a fallen angel and an oath breaker. Ah! Oldbreaker specific, you cannot bind me to your god's whims, true soul. I will not let you. Hmm. Asterion wants us to kill the moth. Asterion wants to join them, apparently. Huh. I mean, I'm not gonna do this for a plus one, I'm sorry. 
if this was a plus 5 or 10, maybe. Um, I'm not gonna choose option 3, we are going for the Oathbreaker one. Your allegiance should be to me and the Absolute. While you hold on to your past, you are worthless. Ah, shit, he actually... Okay, she actually starts the fight with this one. That is, uh... A little bit cringe, I'm not gonna lie. Alright. Starion. You are the first. How do I get there? Without having to waste my bonus action. Okay, I, I will dash and I'm gonna just bloodlet her. Let's see if I can kill her off without killing her off. Nice, she's bleeding. What is Aura of Protection? she a paladin? Ooh. So, technically, killing them is not breaking her oath. She's not an oath breaker, paladin. Because she's doing it for the god she believes in. So, technically, she did not break her oath. Damn, that's crazy how that works. How the fudge did I break my oath when I'm faithless, though? <laughs> that's what I don't understand, but sure. Uh, she do be modded, and it's bound to not work how I expect it to. Alright. Somehow, I gotta, I gotta kill off Mintara. First of all, I'm gonna do that while she's undead. So I, I will make her undead. I'm interested to see how making her an undead will affect the gameplay. Bro. Alright, come on, Lazel, hit him. Bro. Oh, the eye. Oh, that's so bad. Calling reinforcements. That is so bad, bro. Okay, we got a crit hit. That's good. I may have to break the eye somehow. I'm just gonna move Will here. Um. Yeah, I will import on death onto Minthora. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it all the way over there though. In a single turn. But damn. Come on. I gotta be in melee, bro. I'm almost there. Almost. I, I feel like I gotta heal Shadow Heart. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, keep in mind, I cannot heal Kremiel anymore because she's undead. So, yeah. Okay, let's do an additional... Let's see, that's level 2, that's level 3. Yeah, I'll do a level 2 heal on Shadow Heart. Plus 12, I will take it. And Gale needs to break the eye, but I, at the same time, I need to figure out what this thing's resistant to, because god damn, that's a lot of resistance. So, it's vulnerable to thunder. The only thunder thing I got is Thunder Wave. There's a high chance I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna insta-kill it. Alright, I, I will try. I'm gonna push Will at the same time. Can I push the eye though? It doesn't seem like it's pushing the eye. I'm gonna push Will right up there. I'm a max... Wait, if I, if I do this... Does Will take damage too? I may accidentally kill Will. I'm gonna just... You know what? Sure, level 1 is fine. Let's put him... I will, I will put him right there. Nice. 
I broke the eye, I put wheel there, and he did take damage. Thank God I didn't use a, a level 3 one. I would have probably killed Will. <laughs> oh. Oh, Astarion, you... You Chad, you tanked that like a boss. Will just died, by the way. I only now realized that Will literally just died. Okay. Alright, let's 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 make me and Thora attack. As in attack me. No, if we do that... It's a concentration spell for two turns. Which means next turn I will be unable to make Shadowheart use Valkrana. Because she's probably going to start attacking Kremiel. Let's not do that. Oh. I'm going to try to silence her. It's a 60%, so it may work. Let's try. Oh my god. Okay. Let's try another one. Come on, 60. Let's go, baby. All right. We did, uh, what was that? 11 damage and the silence. Eh, a little bit in the middle. I'll take it, though. That's a two-turn silence. Even though, even though we missed. Alright, what I do know is that I gotta deal with this goblin right now. Because he's a pain over here. For no goddamn reason. Also, the bridge broke when Gale used the thing. Get him. Get him, Karlak. Get him. Beat him up. Alright, I don't think I need more people onto... Onto the goblin. Or onto Mintara, rather. I do have Misty Step. Uh, it needs long rest, cringe. Alright. Hopefully this is enough. Do I lacerate? I don't really want to use the short rest moves, but I mean, not have a choice. Okay. Come on. Hit him. Okay. Let's move a little bit out of the way. I don't want uh, Lazel to just tank a death for no reason. I'm not gonna action surge. What I'm gonna do though is I'm gonna turn Mintara into an undead with the uh, import undeath. Oh, she needs to be ally. Can I make her ally somehow? <laughs> I guess I'm killing off Mintara. I don't know how to do this without having to kill off the grove. Hmm. Huh. If I put her to, her to sleep somehow. But I don't have sleep because I removed that from Gale. Can I switch mid combat? Let's see now. I don't need Grease. No, I can't. Okay. I thought I could maybe switch mid combat. That is a little bit annoying. Also, why does this thing keep going off? I'm pretty sure I I take detect thoughts to be on all the time. But we do have speak with animal. Non-lethal spell attack. Oh. Oh. So I can. Wait. Irreversible destructive spells causing harm to enemy entities override this effect. The fuck you mean? What does this mean? Isn't every spell a destructible spell? Every attack spell? <laughs> that is. Confusion? Okay, I'll try. I'll try.
Okay, that broke her hard, bro. Alright. Let's see now. I don't think I'm gonna crit, but... Let's see if... So everybody has this non-lethal attack. Sheesh! Alright, let's see if this actually works. Can I put her on the ground? She's, she got severe bleeding, though. Uh... Sure. Okay. She... Died. You should take a look. Fuck, man! <laughs> Can I revive her somehow? Uh... I know she's not allied, but is there a way to revive her? Wait, Shadow Heart, Raise Dead, Animate. I, I, I got it, I got it. Hopefully it actually works though. Let's see. Can I make Mintara join me somehow? From yell. Please. Thank you. That's a 55. Alright, let's. I mean, he's gonna. He's gonna be on the ground until I get him anyway, so. Alright, I wanna remove the, the tadpole from Mintara. And then. First of all, I need... Oh, okay, come on. Y'all just on group, sit here. I'ma go rescue good old Will. Oh, I have non-lethal stuff. I'ma kill you off. I do not need Scroot the Goblin boss. I wish I could actually take a look at his equipment. As in his entire armored kit. And whatever else he got going. Where the fuck are you going up there? <laughs> Alright. Let's jump Will back. Why are you going all the... Hello? Just jump, bro. I don't want to miss the step. Is that blood? Alright, Shadowheart, do your thing. Can I... Oh, first of all, let me remove the tadpole. Ooh. Yoink. This one is a true soul parasite. It can enhance you. You can absorb its potential. Open your mind to it. Okay. You already know how so is this why we didn't get the tadpole from other dude, which was there? In the woods, right up front, the the goblin stronghold, the dwarf, I believe, which had two guys over there, uh, just weeping because he did, if you recall. Hmm, I'm not sure about opening my mind to that ball, but at the same time, I'm not sure I want to deny it either, but. I don't really want this goofy ass creature in my head, even though I already got one. But our quote unquote advisor, dream visitor, kinda wants us to, to keep this one. I'm not sure about this. Don't worry, you won't come to harm. I'll protect you. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Let's close mind. You are not ready. That's all right. But try to overcome this resistance sooner rather than later. It will make things much easier for you. Yeah. We'll we'll, we'll see about that. So let's see. She got Janide. She has different equipment from what I remember. 
Yes, I have killed Minthara once before, but she has very different equipment from what I remember. Huh. Alright, I'm not gonna touch the equipment, because if Shadowheart does revive her... ...as an undead... Create Undead Servant. Will this be permanent, though? I am hoping this is permanent. I could have used Life Transference. If I do Life Transference on Kremiel, will that heal Kremiel? That's something I need to figure out. Animate dead. Alright, we need to prepare. If this doesn't work, all right, I'll remove the, the grenade, the grenata. And let's see, we had the ceremony, which I'm not completely sure what it does. Bless water, coming of age, dedication. Uh, I wish it would tell me what each of those does. I'm not gonna lie. Revify. But Mintora is not a companion. Sure, I'll animate that and see how this goes. Please work. Zombie, skeleton, skeleton melee. It is permanent. I can't. Bro! Wait! I can resurrect her? Hold up. I did just remove the tadpole. Oh my god! Wait, does this actually work? I have Revify. I have Revify. Oh, but it's a companion. No! Please! Wait! 100%! Wait! Wait, hold up, hold up! Take you. Oh my god, I can't revive her! Alright. Alright. Um... <laughs> okay. Um, what if I do this and try to topple your ass? I was not aware I could revify her. Okay, this may end up being bad. Okay. Okay. I do have the, the non-lethal toggled. So I wish I could just punch. Alright. Please don't kill her off again. Hit her though. <laughs> Alright. I don't have the concussive smash anymore, but I do have blunt weapon, so I'll just roleplay as if I hit her in the head. Or not. Never mind. Never mind. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, I'll just hit her and hope for the best. Please. Just drop her. Oh my gosh, she doesn't want to fall. Okay. Why can't I just talk, bro? Okay, how do I... She's not dead. She's knocked out. For some reason, Gale, Karlak, and somebody else did not fuck with that one. <laughs> Alright, uh, we leave. We leave. I need to know what happens if I do this.
Will I be able to get Mintara later? Ooh, water sparkers. Electrified. Interesting. I don't know if that's any good, but... Blur. Let me just yoink the war map. Heh, <laughs> now you got no plans, bitch. Uh, at the same time, I will just remove some stuff you got on here. Yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna touch that because I don't know how it's gonna affect. We do remove this spider silk bag. Open? You got anything in extra? Nope. Okay. Let me yoink your supplies real quick. And I'm not gonna touch that one. Just in case I am able to actually befriend her somehow down the road. I did remove her tadpole, so I'm hoping maybe. I'm hoping that's a strong maybe. Alright. <clears throat> I do know you can befriend Minthara somehow. Uh, YouTube spoiled me on that one. <clears throat> but I don't exactly know how. So I'm I'm trying here. Uh, also, let's untoggle the the non-lethal. All right, somebody had animal handling, and I believe it was Gale. Gale's just a giga chat like that, but at the same time, we need to. We gotta catnap Will. Yeah, he does have the thing. I need to catnap Will. My brother in Christ, you need healing bad. Alright, let's do that for Kremiel too. I don't know if it's gonna even work on Kremiel, but we shall see. And I will catnap Shadow Heart as well. Okay, it does work. 27, damn. Will the barely heal. <laughs> Alright, let's on toggle group mode. Uh, I'm gonna jump in there with the dimensional leap. I know there are some spiders here. I'm just not seeing them. I'm not sure why. I do have animal thingy toggled on. I will uh, jump here. Okay, where are you at? Oh, there we go. Large giant spider in the back. I will wrap you, and bind you, and bite you, and eat you. Okay. How about no? <laughs> you should eat a goblin instead. Nice, nice. Let's just make these... I do not know. The cruel and sharp, yes. Bindable and wrappable and biteable. Yes. Yes. Yeah. open the door. Yes. I'll just mage hand the door. Because I can. I will just mage hand the door. Hmm. Yes. Let's we'll see now. I could move my entire party here, but I'm not gonna do that. Oh, uh, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna enter cave mouth. See what's down here. Defiled temple. Hmm. Okay. Okay. I can't see shit, but it's fine. I, I quite literally can't see shit. I have no light. Man, if only I had Lazel here, because she has dancing lights. I don't exactly... <sighs> Man... I do have Misty Stab, but I don't really want to make Lezel go there and waste Misty Stab, but at the same time, do I... I don't gain anything by having Misty Stab right now. So... I'll just go there, question mark? Oh, 
I'll just use the psionic jumps. I think this is the better play. So I'm hoping by increasing my jump, I don't take fall. Bro, that makes no fucking sense. What do you mean? If I tripled my jump distance, why am I taking damage when I jump from here? Because technically, I should be taking less damage or no damage. Okay, it's fine. I'm not gonna... It's just fucking annoying. I just jumped in place. Game? Can you let me jump down there? Holy shit. Oof. Okay. Come on. Wake up. Alright. Um, let's see now. We have never used these, so might as well. I think... Let's see, we got Charisma, Dexterity, Intelligence, Strength, and Wisdom. Um... I think I'll Charisma, because these goblins have a couple spellcasters, which I believe are warlocks. Alright, we got 10 turns of Dancing Lights. I'm uh, not sure if this is gonna work or not, or if it's even gonna help, but we will use it. Just to check what is in here. Wait, that thing doesn't follow? Oh, that's cringe. But I think I saw just enough. No? Brother, there is nothing here. Can I use it multiple times? I can. Oh, that's nice. That's actually kind of cool. Oh, never mind. I can only use it twice? Question mark? Available next turn. Oh! Okay, so I can basically use it whatever, without wasting any spell slot. Okay, that's actually kind of good. Quite ready for you. But what am I doing down here? Why am I down here? Is there anything to gain from being here? Hmm. I can't jump up here, I can't climb up there, so it doesn't seem to do anything. We got some spider webs in here and nothing else, some eggs. Let's not touch them eggs, because we want to befriend spiders, yes. Also gotta remember that Kremiel does have a spell to befriend spiders, yes. Alright, we are summoning Gale outside and Lazel as well. So we do have animal friendship. We got 10 turns of making these badass spiders not attack us. If they decide to attack us, that is. Alright. Okay, Gale. First of all, I need to group. I need to get out of here. Make sure they do not see me. Okay, we will mage hand. Let me mage hand down there, actually. I will mage hand down there. There is a lever there, which is gonna open the door. I'm wondering if I Minthora mean, is still unconscious. I think she is. Okay. All right. Let's untoggle. Ooh, spiders just showing up near the hand. Okay. Let me give you a hand. What do you mean can't use? Use, bro. Bro, I don't care. Use it, for fuck's sake. Hello? 
Game won't let me use it. Why? Alright, what if I move? They, they don't like my hand touching... How do I do this? Why do they not want the hand? Is there a rock I can throw at the lever? Damn, that is weird, bro. Why am I not allowed to do that? Alright, uh, I'm, I'm gonna try to be sneaky. <laughs> I will try to be sneaky. We'll see now. Can I hit that from over here? I'll, I'll try. Will this even work? It does not seem to work. Oh! Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. The gates did open. It insta-closed, though. Wait, the, the fuck? They just hit each other. Oh, that's interesting, bro. Why are these goblins... Oh, they're drunk. Oh, no, they're... The name's Druk. I thought they're drunk. Um... I don't think these spiders can handle it. Yeesh, you're 1 HP, brother. That is not good. That is so not good. Alright, we need to heal Spider. Hmm. But at the same time, I don't technically want to... Bro, this Spider is 1 HP. Can you heal up somehow? Without me having to waste anything to do it. Hmm, interesting how game will not let me... What do I got an alarm upcoming? What? Turn off, brother. What the hell? Why will the game not let me revive the goblins, but they let me revive me in Thora? So I'm assuming at this point... Oh, hello, Razgazelin. Raz at this point, I am just assuming me Thora is gonna be able to join the party, because they did let me revive her. And it's not letting me revive the goblin. Alright. Okay. Which way to the nearest library? Back to getting me some spiders outside the, the gates. It's a little bit annoying that the giant spider does not heal. And it took a bunch of damage, which we don't technically like. Okay, the gates are open. We're heading outside. <clears throat> yes. Bless, bless. Okay. Where is Priestess? I will smack you so hard. Where you at? Where did Priestess go? The hell? Oh, she's down there. I, I like how I'm not getting engaged on. Anyway. Hello? Will you take some damage? What the fuck? <laughs> I tried to hit this so much. Yeah, okay, that makes more sense now. I did see the shield come up, but I didn't think it was a an actual shield. I don't know why. Uh, cleave? Will this miss? Technically, it shouldn't. Are the spiders... My enemies? It looks like they might be. That is so not good. Okay. Annoying. 
Alright. Uh, no, never mind. They seem to be friendly. They, These other guys are blinded. They don't see that I am attacking Priestess Gut. Starion is gonna be a Giga Chat and just carry this right now. Yep, yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Pretty much. Alright, Karlak. Put her out of her misery. Got him, bro. Bro, that was the easiest fight of my life. Priestess Gut got a lot of stuff. I'm out. Little Bia. Yeah, I don't, I don't care for that spider anymore. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't revive. Or can I? Nah, it doesn't let me revive, revive the spider. It's kind of annoying, actually. Anyway. We got Priestess good. Let me check what I got from her, though. Because I, I just had to, to move. I do have two tadpoles. Hmm. Two mind flare specimens. Absolute talisman. Heroism. The fuck? You what now? <laughs> Make yourself for a target immune to frightened and gain 5 temp hit points. Each turn? For 10 turns? Damn! Okay. If the wielder bears the absolute brand, they gain a plus 1 bonus to saving throws. Yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna brand ourselves there. I'm sorry. Heal yourself and increase your hit point maximum by 5. Permanent. This talisman is really good. Unfortunately, I... I can't keep it on me. Momentum. When we cast Concentration Spell. Interesting. While we are concentrating, we can't... Be knocked prone or be moved against our will. Oh, oh, that is good. Wait, this is medium armor. That's actually decent. Wait, why am I not giving this to Shadow Heart again? <laughs> Let me give uh, Shadow Heart this one. Let me give this one to Will. Let's see, we don't have mage armor. He has light armor. I do need to remember that next time I level up. So technically he does have armor. This guy is not proficient in medium armor, but do I still get the effects? You lack training. Uh... Oh my god, so this stops me from casting spells. That is BS, I'm sorry. Um... Yeah, okay. Have a lot on my mind. The only other one that has concentration spells is Shadowheart. The pride of the gate. Well, Shadowheart just got some items. Hmm. Might as well. Might as well equip. Oh, that's kind of nice, actually. Uh, you are proficient with this, no? Yes. Yes. Also proficient with medium, so it's kind of nice. Mintara's mace is Gucci Banana. We have Turn Undead. Damn, Shadowheart can literally just control our lives right now. <laughs> Technically. Because we are dead, or rather undead. Spider just got destroyed, rip. Rustin Pepperoni. Okay, we gotta deal with Raz... Ragslin. Let me close them doors. Unfortunately, I don't have spiders anymore to deal with them, so... Yeah. Okay. I will position Kremiel. In a way in which this makes sense, but first... My guy has 107 HP. Oi, oi, oi. Okay. 
Let's... Let's deal with this. I command you, corpse. Speak. Reveal truth to the absolute. By Vlacket's blade. A geich. Nothing. Must be reading it wrong. Huh. This is the big boss. Strike him down. Okay. The hobgoblin turns to you, and the parasite squirms in your skull. You taste the ale on his tongue and the bile in his soul. The visions cloud your inner eye for a brief moment once again. You see the hobgoblin bowing before the armored elf you'd glimpsed before. The elf speaks of the hunt for a great weapon and the rewards that will go to whoever finds it. The hobgoblin's eyes gleam hungrily. Never saw a true soul like you. But you got the absolute's blessing. Do I? He doesn't speak his next words, yet they still rattle your skull from within. You ever talk to a dead squid? Now's your chance. Um... Hmm. You know, I could uh, talk to the Mind Flayer. We do have speak with Undead, or rather, speak with Dead. Hmm. Let's see now. Let me study them corpses. Because this might give me some information. It's God Planer. A fearsome creature, even in death. But not the one that tormented you. Yet it too roamed the Nautiloid. It would have seen you, known you. Ah, that's not good. Absolute says the dead. Also, it's got a mussy. A mouth bussy. Oh. It and scooted off to that looter camp. We find who killed it, and we find who took that weapon. So settle in. Okay. Nah, I'ma fuck you up, dude. I'm sorry, I'm here to kill your ass, you know? Alright. I could've done this the easy way, but I'ma choose the hard way for once. Uh, I think the easy way is still just to... Well, first of all... Summon them all. There are a lot of people here. But I think the boss is the, the bigger problem, so let me just do this. Okay, high defense. Sure, it's fine. Boom. Hey, it actually hit. That's kind of nice. All right, shadow hard. Hit him hard. Or crit miss for some reason. Even though I got that turn off. Sure. <laughs> I speak. They burn. Okay. I think I melt acid arrow. No, actually, I uh, fireball. I fireball these three. Boom. Hey, let's go, Gale, baby. <laughs> I just one shot two goblins. That feels good. It feels right. Now, did guy bleed? No bleeding at all. Probably because that was blunt damage. Can I sneak hit you? Kinda? Uh, path interrupted. By what? Oh, he's inside Karolak and Will at the same time. <laughs> Not something I thought I would say, but it's fine. Yeah. I will, uh, sneak attack dude. <laughs> I'm just gonna... Uh, no, I can't. Never mind. Oh, this guy provokes attack of opportunity. Why can't I reach my dest- Bro, just move! Oh my god. Okay. Alright, Astarion. You did your job. Pretty decent, actually. Spiritual weapon. This is why I love it, bro. It takes aggro. It ta Oh, they heal. Oh, that's bad. 
Oh, they're, they're healing the boss too. Wait. Mother Yucker just casted a double heal. What the fuck? Oh, that's cringe. Alright. <clears throat> Jumping doesn't provoke attack of opportunity if you can't see me. <laughs> At the same time, I'm not close enough, but for some reason it said it provokes attack of opportunity, question mark? I'm confused. Anyway. Hit him. Hit him again. GG. Alright, we move Lazel close. I could action search, but I do not do that. Because there is no point. I think I summon Shadow Spawn for once to actually see what the flip is going on with uh, this spell. Wait. Fury, Fear, uh, Despair? Reduce movement. Uh, call forth a shadowy spirit that embodies the emotion of fear, allowing it to take the hide action as a bonus while in dim light or darkness. We don't care right now. Call forth a shadowy spirit that embodies the emotion of fury, gaining advantage on attack rolls and frightened. Okay. Sure. Sorry, what now? Why did it jump to... Uh, a confusion? Whose turn is it? Lazel didn't end turn? Wait. Oh, okay. Will's turn is just kind of weird. Okay. I'll just end turn here. Alright, Kremiel going for the balls. Kinda have to. Those two, I'm gonna leave there and I'm gonna blow them out with the... Uh, or, or rather, blow them off the edge with Gale. Um, I think we profane smite here. Or can I do anything else? Let's see, Curse of Shadows. I wish I could enter Wraith form, but I there's too much light here. I could extinguish light. Unfortunately, I am not so sure that it's gonna extinguish the light of the spiritual weapon, but... Let's see! I am kinda risking here. Okay, this thing still does light. I'm, I'm kinda close to good old Ragslin. I'm gonna try to enter Wraith form. Oh, that's bad. He double hits in rage. I'm pretty sure. Eee! Oh, fudge! Okay. Luckily, I heal every turn. Because I'm undead now. Um. Alright, Karlak. I need you to jump. To huff and to puff. <laughs> well, well. Look what we have here. Get him, bro! Or sister, rather. Get him! Hit him hard. Alright. Uh, we need to move here. And boom. Let's go, baby. Alright, I'm gonna move Shadowheart a little bit closer. I need to get Kremiel out of that area. I don't recall if I have anybody in Shield of Fate. But I'm gonna do Kremiel a favor. First of all, let me check. Doesn't do anything if I extra it. Right? I'm gonna do Kremiel a favor and shield of fate her until long rest. Plus two armor class. Which puts us to 21. I can disengage next turn and attempt to enter raid form. Now Gale's gonna do this. Because they very conveniently just sit there i'm gonna probably one shot them anyway but if i don't they're dead anyway i didn't one shot the one dude but he did anyway so that is completely fine all right we hit him good i'm 
I'm gonna just sneak attack the guy. Uh, not the spiritual weapon. I'll sneak attack Drorraglin. That weird ass name, but it's kind of cool in a way, actually. I'll just leave a Starion here. Uh, I feel like uh, this may be a little bit too easy. I'm just gonna pommel. Hopefully it works. Okay, it didn't work. Kinda cringe. Luckily he takes very little damage because he has uh, high resistance to basically everything that is melee. And ranged. So anything that's Slashing, pierce, or... What was that again? Slash, pierce, and bludgeoning. For some reason, guy is extra resistant to those. Gets shit on by spells, though. So... There is that. Oh, I can't control this? Okay, so I, ca I can't control the, the thing. I don't need to control the thing, though. That's the thing. Okay, I think this... Shadows... Oh my god, that shit's a level 7? What? Bro. Alright, I need to disengage. I just want to see what the, the thing does, bro. I want to enter... I want to enter rate form. I need to turn off the lights, though. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna enshroud or whatever it was called. What? Why are you following me, bro? Oh my god! Guy literally just said, fuck your rate form. Yo! My guy is going absolutely mental. Holy. Okay. Bro gotta chill. I was trying to go Wraith for him, but this dude gotta go. Uh, <laughs> okay. This dude just gotta die, bro. Holy. Yeah, that was very, very cringe. <laughs> what just happened? He just... He just said, fuck you and your wraith form to Kremiel. Yeesh. Alright, I... I don't need this anymore, honestly. I'm gonna just dismiss. Uh, whoops, I just ended Asterion's turn, I think. Yeah. Accidental. It's fine. All right, we need to wake Kremiel up. Collected. It might be useful. Actually, Kremiel can just self heal. I forgot. Alive, so, <sighs> so how long does this shadow last for? It's permanent. We cannot control it, but we permanently have a level seven uh, shadow spawn. Terror Frenzy. Wait, I can control it now. Oh. Oh, damn, that's crazy, bro. Oh, my God. Will? <laughs> bro, look at this thing. Whoever made this, damn, that's so good. <laughs> I'm scared the fuck out of some goblins, bro. All right, let me go find some. Wait. Wait. Dreadful scream. Yeah, I'ma just go scream at some goblins real quick. Oh, you will. we fucking them up. Hold up. Oh, never mind. I, I can't control it. It's gonna solo fuck him up though. Let's watch this. How strong? I mean, they're two level ones. Uh, level one and two. Uh, this. Yeah, it's just gonna clean house. Okay. Never mind. For some reason, I can't control it. It does cold damage. It took a lot of damage, though. Oh, 
Oh, it's automated. Why? Can I remove this? I want to use it, bro. I can't use the scream. Why is it automated? That's so cringe. I, I can't seem to be able to remove that. Anyway. So, we beat Dror Ragslin. We beat... Well, first of all, we beat the fuck out of Mintara. We left her unconscious. I don't technically want to kill Mintara off because... I just don't. Because we can't... We can't take her with us. Let's see, does dude got anything on him? No. Can I animate that on this guy? Uh, let's speak with guy, actually. Okay. Rises, your parasite squirms in I was not aware of this interaction with the the mind flare and it's the tadpole. This creature is responsible for your parasite. Ooh. It's waiting Hold up. Tell me who the absolute though. Fractured images fill your mind. Curved drow blades. A drow. Okay, never mind. Teeth, dripping blood. I thought it was a draw. Other mind flayers arranged in a serene circle. Absolute unity. Huh. Absolute power. Why did you abduct me? Dark, empty pods flicker across your vision. They demand new flesh. Fucking weirdos. How did I get the parasite? Not a parasite. Perfection. Rebirth is sloughing flesh. A new skull housing cold, sharp intellect. Okay. Why did the Dragon Riders attack the ship? If I recall, the Dragon Riders were the Githyankis. You watch through the creature's eyes as it curses the starborn slaves. Starborn? The ones from the ship. Slaves. Darkness and sun barely contained. What do you mean darkness and sun? What? What does the absolute want from the goblins? You see draw Ragslin writhe. A tadpole clings to the mind flayer's fingers. The Goblin King bows, obedient. The flesh of his tribe becomes the flesh of the Absolute. Bro, who the fudge this Absolute? Okay, are there more of you here? You see dark tunnels lit by noxious pools of brine. The darkness spreads through the earth. Okay, that's the Underdark. Open and nautiloids pour out of a void that consumes the stars. Oh shit, so there's a bunch of these. Got it. Whoops. Alright. What now? Okay. Huh. Well now. Well, uh, let's loot the goblins. I'm gonna take the void bulb because it's useful. Some supplies, some poison. I may have just said fish again, I'm sorry. Ooh, Fate Breaker. Ooh, that's uh, another Mind Flare. I will take the Javelin. Because it's a thrown weapon. Any more Void Bulbs that I may have missed? Yeah. Okay. So, I think we are currently done with the goblins. We did kill off Mintara once, we revived her. Unfortunately, I can't seem to be able to turn her into undead because it needs to be a friendly target and I have not befriended her. Is there a way I can make her friendly somehow?
My faith will guide me. I want to figure out if I can make her friendly somehow before I move on. Wait, where the fuck am I? Oh. Okay. Bro. Okay, Gail, open these doors, because they're annoying. Thank you. Alright. I need to heal, bro. Okay, didn't mean Tara wake up. Um, wait, are you dead? No, you're not. Okay, thank God, bro. You are knocked out, though. Let's keep it that way for now. Let's see. Can I... I can't speak with dead because it's not considered dead. What if I catnap you? It's not gonna work because she's not friendly. Okay, I just wanted to see what it does. I need to know the interactions. How delicious. Hmm. Spare dying? Target must be downed. It's not downed. Do I have cure? Will cure help in any way, shape, or, or form? Hmm. Prayer of healing, calm emotion. Okay. Is there a way I can just befriend Minthora before I leave? I don't think I got a way to befriend Minthora before I leave, so I'm gonna just have to leave her here. I technically did kill her once. And then I revified her. Which is interesting. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let's remove revify. It's useless right now. I think I... <sighs> I did say I want to test Valkrana's corpse grenade. Because if this works... Uh, you know what? I need to check. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move the entire party away. Or rather, I should keep the party here. So I I'm gonna test something out real quick. Time to rest? I need to check if Valkar a Valkrana Corpse Grenade works. As in, if it heals Kremiel. I may just kill Kremiel off with this one. Alright, gotta keep in mind, she's considered under, okay? So, if I do this... Will this heal Kremiel? Uh, let's, let's not do a level 3, let's do a level... I can't do level 1. Alright, we're, we're, we're doing the level 2. This may just kill Kremiel off, but let's see, it may heal her. I need to see if this heals her or if she takes damage. If she doesn't take damage and she's healed instead, this is gonna be such a fucking broken combination, bro. Alright, testing, testing, one, two, three. No, okay, never fucking mind. <laughs> uh, Alright, but she does revive every time she dies. She does revive every time she dies. So technically, I got a time bomb with this one. I can level 3 bomb everybody, bro. That is 5 to 60. Jesus. Okay. So, yeah, but every, everything that I got on top, as in concentration spells and such, they will all be broken. That is kind of cringe, but it's fine. 
All right. We found a new interaction, which I'm gonna be abusing. Probably. <laughs> okay. Mintara is there. Um, we go talk to Halzin. Technically, we did kill off Mintara, so he should be okay with it. We got... Who? Oh. Where is Astarion? Why are you saying that, uh... What? Hold up, I'm confused. Bro. Do we have any blood in that room? Okay, never mind. Okay, we got him. I like that Asterion heals when he has a pool of blood beneath him. That means every time he gets sniped, he's gonna self-heal. I don't technically need to react here, but at the same time, eh, sure. Let's shade shield. So we got spotted through there, question mark? Through here? I'm confused. Okay, I am very confused as to how they actually saw me, but sure. Time to press ahead. I could have just TP'd here, but I'm not gonna do that. It's fine. Okay, Lazel can't just straight up move all the way there. That is cool. And the sounds from the the shadow spawn, I was gonna call it a... Wait, it is a race. I was gonna call it a race. It is a race. <laughs> it's considered the level 7 race, I just realized. Hit him. Mm, hit him again, please? Bro. What is that? Alright. Enter melee. fuck you doing <laughs> guy just facing the wall all right that looks weird not sure what what the raid be doing but sure i don't mind Korlak getting a little bit of damage on her she can just do this and heal back that's fine smack got him all right there is another one over here sure I think I pretty much killed everybody. Um, have I killed everybody? I don't remember. All right, I'm gonna enter and I don't care for these. Uh, what I do care about is, for some reason I can't dimensional leap on Gale. It's fine. Can I hit the other one? No. Oh well. Oh well. It's fine. Finding my way. Okay, Astarion, can you hit from there? Not really. But... I can't do this. And then I can't sneak attack. No, no, never mind. But I can't just hit you. Shame I can't hit you twice. I'm sorry, but a stereo that, that bloodletting thing is broken, bro. It's so good. The fact that he can just self-heal whenever he gets hit is is busted to me. <laughs> On my way. Okay. Come on, stop making me waste turns. I don't really want to waste all that much resources just to kill off a goblin. Thank you. Alright. Uh, I was gonna talk to Halsin, see what he gotta say. 
Let's see if we can keep both Halston and Mintora. Where Halston at? Okay, he's there. The ringleaders have to die. The very mm, annoying. Thanks to them. All the leaders are dead, technically. You did it. You actually did it. The leader's dead. <laughs> Praise Sylvanus. No, that's not right. Praise you, my friend. The Grove owes you. Uh, keep in mind that you can knock Minthara out without the mods as well. So you can do this totally unmodded, you just kind of need to know how to. I think it's uh, by using a mace, if I recall. You can actually just put her in a, a down state, I think. I think. If I recall, if you hit her with a mace, with the Shadow Hearts uh, bonus action... You can actually put her in a doubt state without uh, killing her. And end combat with that. Alright, let's... Let's get out of this pit, firstly. Sure. Return to the grove. I'll make my own way there. I can see to some matters there, and we can discuss what comes next amidst more bucolic surroundings than here. Alright, now the reason I am trying to befriend Minthora is because, well, she got a tadpole in her head, she may be controlled by this absolute, and we don't technically know if she is or not. So, I'm just, you know, trying to see if I can get her to join. Hey. Alright, anything good in here? There's a dead elf. Not sure where he's trying to go. Mysterious hole. Decaying legs protrude from the hole. A failed escape, it seems. Hmm, let's inspect. My intelligence kind of low, but it's fine. I got strength. Oof, it's not fine. I failed horribly. <laughs> Alright, I'm not gonna roll again for that. The corpse is very dead, but that's all. Yeah, let's just pull. Revealing a tunnel. Perhaps you can escape where he failed. Mm, yeah, let's not do that. Mysterious hole. Actually, nothing a quick blast of magic won't clear. It'll take a bit more effort to clear it. Quick blast of magic, you say? Yes. How about? Five or six. Yep. Oh, that's uh, very annoying. Gale's wild magic surge is cringe. I, I kind of need to remove that somehow. Uh, if possible. Okay, we are in Shattered Sanctum. Where? Oh. Oh, okay. Back to work ban entrance. There was a door. There was a door. Gotta remember, I have not fully explored this... Uh... Oh my god. I've not fully explored the Goblin Stronghold, and I plan on doing that for the next, I don't know, 20 minutes before I end the video. So, let's do just that. Okay, we got water. Fire wine. And a chest. Few healies, I will take them. Ooh, supplies, don't mind if I take them. I don't need a torch. I'm gonna take this water bear. Actually, never mind. I don't technically need these. Alright, well. I think we're done in this room, and I think I missed some ladders. So let's see if I can find these ladders that I have very obviously missed when I came inside the, the the stronghold. They were right at the entrance. 
Who? Who? Oh. Man, why are you trying to enter combat with me? Shut up. Okay. Please snipe. Thank you. Oh, I can teleport right here. That's kind of nice. Um, right there. There we go. There we go. Right. There is one there. And... Where are you at? But you're up here! See, I knew I missed some ladders. And I knew there was an upstairs, I just... Yeah, anyway... That would explain why they saw me. Hmm. Okay. Uh, we do have some dudes in the first room as well. Okay. Got a little bit of disadvantage here, but it should be fine if I move closer. Never mind. How is this outside of normal range? It's quite very much obviously inside range. Okay, never mind. I just realized I can teleport upstairs. Oh, there's the ladder, never mind. I don't have to teleport upstairs. It is fine. It is all good, yes. No time to waste. Alright, can I end this goblin's career? Like now. Path interrupted, never mind. Man, I don't want to waste my resources for these. That's the only problem I got. Also, these boots are lowering my move speed. Not Gucci. Not at all. The Leviathan boots. Yes. Um. Can I jump all the way there? Not really. I can dash. So at least there's that. Bye forever, pal. Okay. We end turn here. I don't technically need Shadow Heart. But it's fine. What I do need is Grandpa Gale to just hit him. But I think I just teleport. Let's see. Right here. Good. Good. And then I do this. I... Do I care about this one? Sure. But at the same time, I don't. I... Okay. Wild magic check. Five turns, bro! This. It's so annoying. Uh, what? How? <laughs> Why? Okay, will you please just get smacked? Bro. Oh my god, I got chromatic orbed. A, a double heal? What? Okay, I did not think that would happen. At this point, I think I just kind of have to, to get in real close and smack these fools. Because they're kind of asking for it. Come on. Bro. Sure, I might as well axe no surge at this point. No time to waste. Man, can I No. Okay, it's fine. So I technically got four hits if I action surge, but yeah, I don't usually want to use it. Um, can I teleport all the way over there? Not really. Is this bonus? Yes, it is. Kind of cringe, but it's fine. All right, William. Uh, 
feet of foot. It's fine. Alright, just jump, my dude. Oh, my, my thing is... So do I need at least three me Oh, I need at least three meters of move speed. Oh, I see. Well, okay. So much for peace. Yeah, okay. I was not gonna use all this, but at this point... At this point, I don't care. I'm just smack. Are you serious? Like, are you actually serious? 80% <laughs> by the way. Alright. Let's pick Grandpa up. He's gonna die electrified again. <laughs> Alright, we pick him up again. It's fine. What? Oh, okay. Yeah, Leviathan thingies. I forgot. I forgot. Alright, there is a door here, which I have not checked. Also, we do have these. So technically, I could enter these rooms now. Hmm. At the same time, I kind of just want to go upstairs. Have I been here? There's a goblin in there. Brackal. Nasty surprise. Caution is warranted here. The absolute might of ah. Someone's reaching in. They're sick of life in the ups. Praise is ever bleeding axe. Praise is thrown of flame. So, dude's not with the absolute. You know Maglubiet, a tyrannical deity who treats his goblinoid followers as slaves. Okay. Trying to interrupt my prayers? Scared of a real god? You're as goonless as the rest of them. Um, just pray to whoever you want, it's a free world. Up like a bloody Racist much? Because <laughs> I'm loyal to McLoviet. Because I ain't having my head turned by some upstart god. Hmm. I assume you mean the absolute, yes. My old tribe's fallen for this shite, traitorous bastards. The great absolute brings us together. Drow and gnolls and goblins all braiding one another's hair. It's a load of sight. Hmm. You don't like your people mixing with outsiders. Talking hmm. to you, ain't I? I just don't believe in all this togetherness and chumminess. Ain't natural. It won't last. <laughs> They'll be tearing each other soon enough. Sodom all. I'll wait it out in air, praying to a real god. Okay. I can disarm this. A Stereon can pretty much just easily do this. Sure, let's just disarm this. Because my guy does not like the absolute. Bam, 32. That's probably the highest die roll I've ever had. Jesus. Alright, Gale. Do your thing. Knock a lock. Okay. The fact that they even know, bro. Are you serious? All right. Break them. Oh. 
I mean, you already know what's gonna happen here. There we go. There we go. A little bit of getting destroyed is what's gonna happen. Let's see, can I hit from here? I can. That's kind of nice. No, I can't. Uh, actually, yes, I can. I just need to make sure I angle this correctly. How do I still get critical misses, bro? What, should I do? what you should do is try to smack a fool. Feel my okay. Smack a Starion. No? Good, good. Very good. Oh, Lazel can ranged attack this. I could have maybe jumped, but... Yeah, we don't care. I don't technically care with Kremiel to go there. I'm gonna let this guy loose, see what happens. I've never saved this guy before. Last time I tried, I accidentally broke the cage because I didn't know there was a trap. <laughs> and he died. Oh my god, the camera! Of course you missed that. Ah, oh, damn you, Kremiel. Why'd you have to miss? Okay. Alright, let's move here. Make sure we don't accidentally get pushed. Oh, there's another one. Where? Oh, my guy behind. Okay. I'm sorry, what? A Starion? Can you do your thing properly? Thank you. Jesus. Well, let me pick up Grandpa Gale. Might as well. Can I hitch from here? How is this not... How is this not enough movement? He's right in the range. What the fuck? Uh, this game sometimes, bro. He is right in range and I cannot hit him. Why? Nice. Let's get out of this smoke and hit him. Okay, hit him. Bro. Oh my god. Please just hit him. Thank you. Look at where the absolute love gone. Dead. Thanks for breaking me out. Gonna find me a new tribe. One that appreciates the old ways. Okay. So... Shouldn't have wished to live in more I think I'm now. gonna just, uh... Head on over to Saza. And I think, uh... If she got nothing to say for herself... For her actions of basically being... Fucking useless. After I saved her, I will kill her off. And then we got this uh, thing of Saluna. Okay, Shadowheart, you got nothing to say? I just had to check. Um, let's see now. Gale. I need you to teleport. Now the question is, do I go to the Underdark after the Goblin Stronghold? Do I go to Underdark? Priestess Quarters. Oh wait, there was somebody that was giving me Thora orders. Was that the Priestess? I don't recall. But there is this room in which they... Uh, came and uh, they, they did allow us to stick to this one I did open heavy chest so let me yoink some gold 
And there seems to be a burrow hole up there. Unfortunately, I cannot enter burrow holes. Can I dimensional leap up there though? There we go. Can I enter this burrow hole? I'm Never mind. And that's a very there is a rocky crevice there. So let's see. Perhaps if there were considerably less of me. Okay. So I literally cannot go there. Okay. Well. Um. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna dimensional leap there again. And I need to be quick about it too, because I gotta end the video. Uh, we knock the door. And we enter this. Mouth's acid arrow. Oh. Polema, who? Cremiel minus five. You sense it oh. might be time to leave. Oh damn! Three thousand gold. Try to convince them? Question mark. Intimidation. Sure. Let's try to intimidate a big old ogre. Ah, uh, that almost worked, question mark. I'm not gonna waste the inspiration. Alright, Polma, you're about to get smacked. Because I wanna get there. Shut up, bro. Uh, let's try to convince again. For some reason it's allowing me to. <laughs> Routine, yes, yes, of course. Okay, never mind. Absolute failure. For outstage, you're already flimsy welcome. And now, you will leave. I will leave when I damn well please. Bro, shut up! Oh my god. Okay, I'm smacking this one. Quirk. Uh, sure, let me bone chill. Of course you miss. The one bone chill I ever use, you miss. What is your int? It's 16, how do you miss that, bro? How do you miss that? Kurt. Another one. There we go. That's a big old target. Karlak, get in there. Smack an ogre. There is a key there. Um, Legacy of Avernus. That's a lot of damage. Okay, we are gonna do this because I plan on resting soon. Actually, let's not do that. I know it's a big old ogre, but still. There we go, there we go. A slam. Yeesh! That's a lot of damage. Okay. I was planning on using Kremiel as a bomb, but now that Karlak is there, I'm not gonna do that. Bro, how do you dodge those on 70%? That's so annoying. Are you serious? It's such a big target, bro. Come on. A disarm? Sure. Okay. One more. Hey, let's go. Alright, Karlak. Got him. 
There is a club. Polma, you got something? You got some supplies. There is a gilded chest in here. Misty step. Nice. Even though I don't technically care for it right now. Because I got, well, teleport party, but it's nice that you can actually get that. There is a padlock key here. There's a wardrobe. We got some scrolls. Okay. Let's read this. Okay. Gotta recite from now on. See, this is why you read. Because you may get some stuff. Just by reading. Okay, there's nothing here. Um, I think I am done with the, the Goblin Stronghold. There may be something that I, I may have missed somewhere. I can't open this apparently. So let's see if there's anything in this room. Scroll of Hold Person. A basic potion. And there seems to be nothing else in here. Let me get Melf's Acid Arrow. Burning Hands, which I somehow missed. And a potion. I'm gonna assume the perception was on the thing here. A pouch. Oh. A ring. Any good? Nope. Ah, sure, I'll take it. Alright, let's, uh... Seems simple enough. First of all, let's group everybody. It's let's go climb a ladder. I'm not sure what that white light is all about, but sure. I need to find the ladders again, bro. Alright, hold on. Let me put my magic in. Yes. So this was where that dude was, okay. There's a Saluna. I saw ladder somewhere around here. Wait, can do I even need the ladder? Can't I just Nah the game won't actually let me do that. What the f Hello? My camera just went crazy. Okay. There's another something there. Which the game kind of shows me for whatever reason. Can't seem to teleport where I want to go. Okay, I'll just... I'll just take these two ladders. It's fine. Ah. My Raphael? What manner of the angel? This? Yo! To redemption? What are you... Or huh. Road to damnation. Why is... To say the other angel here? Or the half angel? Is just beginning. What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps. The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that? Love. Was that? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormir, don't they? I actually wish Cremiel was here. I'm Raphael. But it's fine. Very much. At your service. Hmm. Pleasure, I'm Gail. Charm, <laughs> I'm sure, in more ways than one. We should have a chat, you and I, but not here. This quaint little scene is decidedly too middle of nowhere 
for my tastes. Come. Okay, this is... Um... There. Middle of somewhere. Okay. Can you be more specific? Of hope, where the tired come to ah, rest. that's an arch devil. Come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. After all, it might just be. Motherfucker, all. it just threatened me twice. Are these theatrics leading somewhere? Are you not entertained? Well, far be it from me to disappoint. Oh shit, he's an arch devil. Alright. What's better than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? Potentially. An adversary. Conceivably, but a savior. Yeah, let's not make a pact with the devil. What? I don't care what you are, I, I care what you want, which is probably something Gail would say. Oh, a mere trifle. How dear is one's soul, really? A rhetorical question, of course, but let me venture an answer. It's worth very little with a tadpole in your head. One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. Um. Yeah, let's, uh, let's not make a deal with the devil. Is madness, but a denial of reality. Still, I have a feeling you change your mind before it's changed for you. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair, that's when you'll come knocking on my door. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. Hmm. And if I do want to take the zeal, how would I find you? I'll be around, watching you squirm like a tadpole through a nice juicy brain all those pretty little symptoms sundering skin dissolving guts they haven't manifested yet have they one might say you're a paragon of luck i'll be there when it runs out this guy bro all right uh, I gotta move fast here because I gotta end the video. I, I I really gotta go. So let's grab everything I can from upstairs. What is this? Okay, I can't go there. Let me teleport to other side real quick. Avoid the basically puzzled road. Time to run. Okay, let's see now. We are teleporting all the way there. Hey, another chest. There is nothing in one. In this one, rather. Okay, there was Mintora. Can I teleport there? I'll just teleport here first. Check the 
chest. Okay, I don't think I can fall. Not with wasp, anyway. I'll just teleport around because it's way faster than moving. There's a wooden crate with one thing inside. Some tongs, we don't care about that. There was another leather here. Grease bottle, I'll just take it because I can. Alright, I think that is the entire goblin stronghold. I think. I may be wrong, but I think that's it. I don't technically care for moving all the way through this. I already know how to get to the Underdark, so if I want to go there... There is a hidden goblin stash. I think I just gotta go to the grove at this point. I think Halsin left. So the grove it is. Alright. I'm gonna end the video here and uh, next time we go back to the Emerald Grove. See what Halsin gotta say. And maybe just maybe head on over to the Underdark. Because I don't think I'm ready to face the Githyanki again. I'll see you guys next time.